Hey guys, happy Friday. It's literally the perfect day out. I'm starting my Friday in the best way. So I'm on my way to Pinkberry <laughs> because I have been craving it for the longest. So I'm just gonna have some froyo and I'll probably just take it home and just have a nice chill afternoon. I'm home. I have secured the goods. <laughs> oh man, I'm so ready to dig in. See, these are the times where I wish I had a balcony because it's so nice out that I really want to enjoy the weather. But at the same time, after working, I just want to like go home and just chill on the couch. Do you know what I'm saying? But if I had a balcony with some patio furniture, I could just eat my pink berry and be super happy but it's okay anyway i've got to show you guys <laughs> i am not the girl that gets frozen yogurt and puts like fruits and that's on it no 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 this is what my pink berry looks like so i got captain crunch m m's sprinkles i did get some mochi and then i topped it all off with some caramel sauce because it wasn't unhealthy enough for me so here we have it Mm. yeah this is it i also always get the pomegranate flavor sometimes i'll add some peanut butter in there but this is amazing mm -hmm. so i'm just gonna sit here and enjoy this um i might check in with you guys later i might be in a food coma who knows i hope you guys are enjoying your friday or i guess whenever you see this it won't be friday but hope you guys are enjoying your week and i'll catch up with you guys in a little bit Oh my goodness. I just spent the last few hours of my life filing my taxes. Basically, I've just been on the couch since you last saw me doing that. Um, no one should have ever told me that there was an extension because I have literally never procrastinated more in my life. It is Friday, taxes are due Monday, and I just, I just waited to the last minute, honestly. But I knew that I was gonna file them myself. That's what I did last year. And last year, I actually qualified for free tax filing through H&R Block, but I didn't this year, so I did it through TurboTax. And let me tell you, that was not free. So I literally kept pressing the free option. They offer like free, deluxe, plus, and all throughout my taxes while I'm trying to file them, they kept like advertising the deluxe plans and saying, oh, you can have someone help you prepare your taxes and offer input and all this stuff. I kept opting out. I just wanted the free file option. But then finally it came time for me to like input my education repayment info. And they were like, oh, you can only do this with Deluxe. So basically for me to input all of the information that I needed for my taxes, I needed the Deluxe plan, which is just so annoying. Like they should just say that up front. But anyway, it was just a mess. So now several hours later and $120 later, I have filed my taxes. So yeah, imagine that filing your own taxes and still having to pay $120 for it. What? And no, that's not money that I owed because I'm actually supposed to be getting money back. That's just me paying to file my own taxes. Oh my gosh. I can't even. It's Friday night. <laughs> I'm clearly not doing anything. So I don't know. I'm just getting ready for bed at this point. I'm so exhausted from all that. Um, so yeah, hopefully tomorrow will be a better day. <laughs> Hello, hello. I'm not too sure where I left off last night, but it is the next day. I had to wake up a little bit early today because it is my sister's birthday. So she wants us to meet at my mom's house. So I'm guessing we're just gonna have a bit of lunch and probably cut a cake for her. But I do have to stop at Sephora before because I was gonna order her gift online, but then it said it was gonna take like a week for shipping. So I just decided to do an order pickup. So I'm gonna go to Sephora first and then I'll head over to my mom's. So I really haven't done much this morning aside from have breakfast, but I am gonna go ahead and start getting ready now. So I'll come on back once I'm all set and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Okay, so here is the OOTD. I'm honestly super embarrassed by how wrinkled this is, 
but I don't own a steamer, so I'm definitely going to be investing in one because this is like out of control. But anyway, I'm pretty sure I showed this exact outfit in one of my past Zara hauls. So I just have this poplin shirt um, and I have it cinched in with a belt, some biker shorts, and then these Zara boots. And I just wanted something a little bit casual, but still kind of looking put together. I think I'm gonna just iron this shirt once I get to my mom's house because <laughs> it's driving me crazy. But anyway, here's my look. I didn't wanna go too fancy, obviously, since we're just gonna be hanging out in the apartment. So yeah, this is what I've come up with. And I really also wanna take some pictures because it's not often lately that I get dressed up. So I think I might just snag up my tripod and go to my courtyard downstairs and just snag a couple photos for Instagram. And if I do get some good ones, I'll just put a sample of one here. But lately I've been really into like planning out my Instagram feed. So I might not post it right away because I do have a few photos already planned. But yeah, I am gonna go ahead and do that now and then I'll head over to my mom's house. It is so beautiful out and we got the shot. I got a few to choose from, so I do do some editing on Lightroom, but I think we got a good one. Hey guys, I'm back home and I just looked at myself and I'm actually shocked at how well my makeup has held up despite being in a mask. You know, aside from my lipstick, of course, but everything else, like the face looks really good. And usually my makeup is completely gone by the time I get to my destination. So I haven't really been bothering wearing makeup at all when I'm going out with a mask. But it really held up today, so I'm pretty shocked. I don't think I did anything differently aside from maybe apply more products. So maybe that's the key for me. But anyway, I did end up doing my little bi-weekly Trader Joe's trip. So I'm not going to do a full haul, but I did have to show you that they got a new flavor in the little wine product thing. <laughs> so this one is called Mango Chini, and it's mango and coconut. Two of my favorite things. This is like tropical heaven. So I cannot wait to have this. I think I might even have a glass tonight. I don't know. I'm just kind of feeling it. I'm feeling the vibes. I'm feeling the mood. Mango, coconut. I really hope this doesn't disappoint. All right, let's see what we got. Cheers, guys. Mm. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. This, yes, yes, Joe, you did it right. Tastes just like mango and coconut. Tropical beach wine, sweet, bubbly, fizzy drink. I'm feeling this. Yeah, I'm just gonna hang out on my couch, drink this, and have a good night, relaxing night. Also, I gotta show you guys my outfit. What has this turned into? Cheers. <laughs> what am I wearing? It was all cute before, and now this is what we're doing. Anyway, guys, I'm going to have a little relaxing night. I'll probably post up with some Netflix, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good morning, guys, and happy Sunday. Today is just going to be a super chill day for me, I think. I'm having one of those lazy Sundays, so I've just hopped right back into bed, and... I don't know, I have my breakfast here on this little side table thinking that that'll help me from making a mess, but we'll see, I'll probably end up moving over to my couch. I did wanna get some editing done today, and as you guys might already know, I don't have a desk in my apartment. Maybe that's something that I should have prioritized, but I have been working in person all year, so I didn't really think I needed one. But as for YouTube, I usually do my editing on my couch, and that seems to work out fine. I mean, I do have to use a pillow to support my back but today I thought maybe I'll do it from my bed so we'll see how long that lasts so yeah I'm just gonna get going on editing and eating this breakfast and I'll see what I get into later
so I am just in the middle of laundry, but I remembered that I promised to show you guys the few pieces that I picked up from H&M a few weeks ago. So I have them right here. Um, basically, I just got like three clothing items and then a couple accessories. So I will start with my favorite piece, which is this like, I don't know what you would call this. To me, it's like a shirt cardigan. Um, but it has this really nice corset detail in the front where you just kind of snap it together So I really like that and it looks really nice on I'll show you guys in a little bit And then I picked up these black denim shorts and I really like them because they had a little extra length to them I really don't like when shorts are too short on me. So these were the perfect length and then finally for clothing I got this jacket. So I have been wanting a quilted jacket for quite some time and I loved the color of this one. I do have a few jackets in this color, I'm not gonna lie. So I really didn't need it but I still picked it up. I got this in a size medium and everything else is, let's see, this is also a medium and the shorts are a size 6. So I'm gonna go ahead and try everything on for you but before I do, here are the little accessory pieces that I got. The first one being this little teacup mug. I thought this was so pretty. I really love kind of the texture that it has and the tones. It's cream, but then it has like small touches of a nice brown color and that's what it looks like. Now I do already have a mug set, so I didn't really need a complete set, but I thought I'd just pick up one at least for now. And then if I do end up liking it, I could always get more. Um, so I got that and then the second thing is just a set of earrings You can never go wrong with some hoops So I needed a new pair and these are the perfect size I don't usually like them too big as you can see I'm wearing a pair right now that's slightly smaller So yeah, that is everything I picked up I'll go ahead and try on these items for you so you can see what they look like on Okay, so I've just tried on the shorts and the top together and as you can see the shorts are just a little bit longer than your average pair which make them perfect for me and here is what the top looks like i love this outfit even just the way it is and i really like how everything fits i think it's perfect okay so here is the jacket i obviously wouldn't wear with this outfit because it just doesn't even make sense but i really like how oversized it is how loose fitting and just the color of it is really nice so that is what that looks like it's got this cool little split on the side and yeah so I just found out that tonight is the Miss Universe pageant, so I'm just going to spend the rest of my night watching that. And I just wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching this weekend vlog and catching up with me. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! The winner of the 69th Miss Universe competition is... The